What's going on YouTube? In this quick video, I'm going to show you how to restore a Mac to factory settings and erase it. So if you're trying to sell it or if you're just trying to re restart from a clean slate, this is how you would do it. Um, so the first thing you want to do is go up to the Apple logo, click on about this Mac, and this is where you're going to write down all your information if you're trying to sell it. So this is what you would put in the listing for what you're trying to sell it. You can see all the information, the display, the storage, everything. So once you've done that, the next thing you need to do, if you so please, is back up your Mac. And for me, I'm just using um, Time Machine, which I already backed up. So if you don't know how to back it up, I'll probably have another video for that here shortly for you to do. But for now, just back up your computer. Once you've completed that, we're going to go into System Preferences and we're going to sign out of iCloud. It's very important that you come to the bottom here. You sign out of uh, Find My Mac. Sign out of that and sign out of iCloud. You can just follow all the directions. Okay, once you're signed out of iCloud and you do everything, prompt everything, if you want to back up everything, it'll ask you all that. The next thing you want to do is you're going to want to sign out of iTunes. This is important so that if you're, um, you keep this open, so you go to Account, Authorizations, click Deauthorize this computer. Okay, once that's deauthorized, if applicable, you want to launch iMessage and sign out of that. But I never signed in, so if you need to do that, make sure you do that. Then, once you've done that, you should be good to get to the restore process. So, what you need to do is hit restart on your computer and I will show you how to get it to go into reset mode click restart and then on the keyboard you're going to hit command and R and hold it until the laptop boots so I will just stay on the video so you can see the process So I'm still holding Command and R. Do, 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 do. Still holding. Alright, now after what seems like an hour and a half of holding those two buttons, what you're going to want to do is come down here to the Disk Utility option. Once on the Disk Utility option, you're going to come up here to the Macintosh or whatever drive you your operating system on. You're going to hit Erase right up here. Click on that. You want to make sure that you format it in APFS. Click 
with erase. It'll go ahead and delete it. So now the drive is completely wiped. So the next thing we're going to have to do is take get a close out of disk utility. Go to reinstall Mac operating system. And it'll prompt you to install the OS. So I'm going to go ahead and install it. It's important that you do this, especially if you're going to sell the computer, um, so that it's ready to be set up by the new user. fun stuff. So here's your wipe drive. I don't know if you can see it, but it says um, it's pretty much empty because I wiped the whole drive. Click install. I will connect it to a power source to make it happy. And it'll start installing the operating system. I will be right back once it's done with this. Alright, after about 15-20 minutes, you'll be prompted with the welcome screen. Now this is where, um, if you wanted to sell the computer, this is where you would just close it down or shut it down and it's ready to be sold. If you like the video, please like it. If you have any questions, leave a comment down. Hopefully me or some other people in the community can help you out. Um, subscribe helps me out significantly. Um, hope you guys have a fantastic day and I hope this really helped you out. Thanks.